Now at 5 o'clock, nine former employees fired for refusing to be vaccinated against COVID-19 are suing a Cripple Creek mining company. KRDO News Channel 13's Annabelle Childers explains why the workers claim the company unjustly retaliated against them. These nine employees worked at Newmont Mining up until January 2022. They say the company's vaccine mandate forced them to either violate their religious beliefs or be fired. It was heartbreaking for a lot of people and scary. In 44 pages, nine employees allege religious discrimination by Newmont Mining, including Jonathan Elliott, a former heavy equipment mechanic there. They came out and basically rolled everything out, which said we had until January to be vaccinated or we could resign or be terminated. Elliott was fired along with eight others who still today stand strongly by their decisions. I've got a very strong military background. Um, my convictions, my religious and my moral uh, were just absolutely no. You know, I I don't believe it was the right thing to do. I don't believe as a, as a Christian man, it's the right thing to, to force someone to do. The lawsuit outlines a timeline of events. In October 2021, Newmont announces a vaccine mandate and a few weeks later, a deadline to get the shot. They say if employees don't receive all COVID-19 doses by the end of January 2022, they will be discharged or have the option to resign. Elliot says they were given the option to request religious accommodation, but the requests were denied. It was a very, very good paying job, uh, which is pretty rare up here in Teller County. You know, when it was denied, it was it was heartbreaking. As of today, Newmont no longer has a COVID vaccine requirement. A little over a year later to say, OK, it doesn't matter now. You don't you don't have to have it. You know, it's. It's depressing. Newmont Mining says they are aware of the lawsuit and believe they fully complied with the law. The company says it plans to vigorously defend itself in this lawsuit. Reporting in Cripple Creek, Annabelle Childers, KRDO News Channel 13.